Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to download a Flash game. Now there's many, there's many uh, things on YouTube that say how to download a Flash game, but this time I'm going to do a little something different to make myself a little different. There's a, because there's a common misconception that you need a SWF player or something to play a game on a computer or to play a Flash game on your computer. No, that's not true. Because if you've already installed Adobe Flash Player on your computer, you can use that to play the downloaded Flash game. And I'll, here I'll show you how to do it right now. So to start off with, you're going to go to Firefox. Okay. Um, let's see, as soon as it'll load. <sighs> I'm going to try to make this as quick as possible because I noticed the more I talk, the less y'all watch. So I'm going to try to make this as quick as I can. Okay. Let's go to, I don't know, gamesfree.ca. Just a little tip here and just a little interesting. E. Free. Oops. Dot. CA. So it's is games free dot dot CA. That means Canada. NEZ means New Zealand. Uh, all different extensions like Kickstarter PH means f dot dot PH means Philippines. Just a little interesting little thing I thought I would share with y'all if you didn't know the end, if you didn't know the extensions of, you know what I'm saying? If you didn't know the extensions of, um, some, besides like, it can be based on the regions and stuff. <sighs> uh, I already have several Flash games downloaded, but we'll just pick one. Alright. Let's just pick up fighting one. I like fighting up oh, and or an ad. Let's click out of that. I like fighting. Let's do fighting. Where was it at? No, I lost it. Okay, here we are. <coughs> Let's just pick a random one. I haven't played this. I'm just picking a random one that I ain't done here. So when I put it on my computer, it's kind of... Now you can actually download their games without doing it this way. I understand that, but I'm gonna show you how you would do it on a um, non-downloadable where they say, "Oh, you can download our games if you want. We don't care." On a website that that, that uh, just doesn't have that option. Okay, so every website is different, but. What you're gonna do is you're gonna always hit play now because you want you want to play it, right? <coughs> Spec Ops, Spec Ops three play today? No, I'm not. Is that game any good? Leave a uh, leave a comment in the description. Because I've been thinking about playing it. I mean, I know I said no, I'm not. But tell me if it's good or not. Because I've been really thinking about maybe playing it. Because I always see that every time. I'm, I'm like, um, is that a good game to play or not? If any of y'all know, let me know. <coughs> because. Yeah. This game should not be taken seriously. Blah, 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 we know. Okay, now we have the... What? The... For Gundam style, dude. Gangman style, I mean. Awesome, though. That song is pretty cool. Now, see how it's... See how it's loaded already? Okay. I'm gonna click... On the outside of it, gonna go to view page information. Gonna go to media. 
It's gonna have all these shift heads, blah blah blah, come in that dot storage dot w s w f and all these. You know find something that says Hmm You know find something that says like Ten Man style floor or something on it. If I could find it The bra I would guess it would be this. It's some of them are not really clear. I'm gonna click save as. I recommend you save it to your desktop. And this is for Firefox, because I find it the easiest way to download flash games. Save as type. It's gonna save it as an automatic SWF. So I'm gonna click save. Cause that's what the file is. See how, see how right now it shows the F right there on yours, on people that haven't done this yet. It's just going to show a blank page and you're going to be like, oh, I need an SWF player. No, you don't. This is how you use your own. This is how you use your own Adobe Flash player that you already have installed on your computer to play Flash games that you that you've already that you've downloaded just like I showed you how to do there. Okay, so see how it's already like that and you can do all that well. For you, for people who haven't done this yet, it's going to show, let's exit out of this now that we have the game downloaded. And that too, we don't need that or that, we don't need that too. Okay, so now that you have the game downloaded, um, I'm just going to show you on any of them because... Okay, I've downloaded so many of these already, so what you're going to do is it's going to be a blank page. It's not going to show the F right there. All you have to do, you have to go open with, well, well, first of all, before you do any of that, okay, before you do any of, after you download the Flash game, stop. Exit out of everything, uh, exit out of all your browsers, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go to control panel, okay? Then you're gonna, okay. Then you're gonna see the Flash Player 32, but in this is for Windows 7. Any other operating system, I'm not sure. If you're not sure if yours has it or if it doesn't have it, message me and I'll help you figure that out, okay? If it doesn't have the Flash Player 32, but okay, now when you, when you go to the control panel and you just click on that, it's an option menu. Like, option for the Flash Player 32 bit. But if you click, but if you drag a link, like like here, like I have on my desktop, as you can see right here, and then after you drag, after you drag a shortcut, basically to the options, okay. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to open with. See, because this isn't gonna have the F on there, obviously. Like I'm. Like I keep saying, I'm just kind of trying to remind you. Alright, so. Then you're going to go to open with. Mine already has it. I have the beta version of Adobe. Or it, it does it with the most. Recent, I also have a. Um, a beta version of Flash Player, but it uses. The one that. The one that, you know, that's on your computer. The beta one I have is the plugin, but anyways, that doesn't matter. Okay, so you're going to go to choose default program. Now, for those of you that don't have it, it's not going to show that, obviously. I know I keep saying it, but I just want to make sure you all have it, you know. So, then you're going to go to browse. <clears throat> It's gonna come up with all these programs. We're gonna be like, oh my gosh, what do I do now? Okay, so here's what you do. You go to, <clears throat> you type in desktop, and then it's it's gonna say program. You're gonna be like, okay, now you go to the Adobe, 
No, what you're going to do is you're going to go to all files first. And then it'll come up with a link of what's on your desktop. Watch. Watch. I'm kind of streaming, but I'm just, I'm all ready today, so. Now you're going to see, oh. And then you're gonna click on the Flash Player 32 bit shortcut. And then it'll let you play that game using your computer's uh, Adobe Flash Player that you have on your computer. Now, for me, if I click on it, it'll say. It'll say. What does it say? I don't even remember. I haven't done this in a while. Flash Player 32 bit shortcut to no touch interface supported. No, that's just because I already have it as the default thing and you can't do it again. Okay. But as you can see, if I can find that new game I downloaded. <coughs> Shift Renegade Decision. All these Flash games, I don't even know which one. Shift Renegade Decision to Dragon. Okay, see, that's the Madness Project Nexus. Let me try to find my game, my one that I downloaded already, though. I know it's not the bottom one decision. Huh. I don't know what I did with it. See, this is... Um, but as you can see, with that, with that, with that option, you can do that, though. As you can see, and just to prove to you I didn't change the file format, I know this video is long, and I know, like I said, it's not about how many viewers I get, it's just about releasing them. Okay, so, as you can see, here, I'll show you. It's still in the SWF file format. And it knows exactly what to use now. So that's how you download a Flash game and use your own Adobe Flash player on your computer. And you don't have to download an SWF player. Any comments, questions, something doesn't work, don't hesitate to post. Um... Thank you for watching. Like I said, one more time, I know you ain't gonna watch all the video and probably none of y'all are going to because I'm so bad of a, of a speaker sometimes. But if any of y'all make it to the end of the video, y'all, thank you for, you know, watching my videos. Even if I get two or three, I don't care. One, I just do the videos just to release them because that makes me, I love doing it. I love, I love exp finding things on the computer and sharing them. Just like with the Pandora thing I did or the Skype thing I did for those of you that are subscribed and that watch them maybe sometimes or whatever. Thank you for watching my videos. I mean, even if it's like I said, one, it's, it means a lot to me. So, thank you.